So here we are at uh, GeneX, GeneX's booth at VMworld. Let's go talk to them about what they're doing. So Chad, tell me a little bit about what GeneX is doing with the uh, Cloud Director. So we're really excited. We've been in beta test with VMware for approximately three months now, helping them develop the Cloud Director. And we're excited now to be able to offer this um, basically a fully automated self-service solution that allows the, the end user to actually go in and manage their own computing resources um, via, the, via the Cloud Director interface. Um, so if you take a look here, we give you full access um, into the Cloud Director where you can go in and manage your virtual data centers. So you as the end user would simply be able to, to log in to Cloud Director manage your own resources. So in the past, what's, what's taken days and even weeks to spin up physical infrastructure and equipment now only takes a matter of minutes and a few clicks of the mouse. Here you come in to your virtual data center. You can have m multiple virtual data centers here. You simply go over to your vApps where you can assign your processor memory and storage and it simply brings it into your virtual data center where you can manage accordingly. Cool. <laughs> so within, within the My Cloud tab, this is where all the vApps are listed. As you can see, you can, you can name them whatever you want. So you've, you know, your, your finance department has a vApp. Um, your, your manufacturing department has a VAP, your sales department, um, it would all be listed here. And then with, within the VAPs are the virtual machines. So as you can see here, you have your virtual machines and your virtual apps over on the right. So it tells you where that virtual machine is assigned. So VAPs are uh, group virtual machines together for different purposes. Is Correct. That, okay. Cool. As the administrator, you have full control over your organization's resources, and you can assign different users. Um, you can assign different users and different departments, and assign them various levels of of access to their resources. So, in the event that you need to, that the administrator needs to um, turn up a, a new VAP or create a new VAP, simply come in here. You can assign it to certain departments or organizations or business units within your organization for, for a specific amount of time. So you can set a lease term which allows you to, to distribute that, that VAP for a certain amount of time and then bring it back into the, the main resource pool once that duration and time frame is over. Very cool. So uh, as an end end user of this system, like what's, what are my benefits, like what am I getting out of using something like this? Um, cost effective, efficient, um, so, so like I said before, um, being cost effective from the perspective that you have the ability to pay as you go, it's an on-demand solution, um, so you don't have to deploy capital for, for physical infrastructure, um, and, and then two, efficiency. You're able to log on here, spin it up in a matter of minutes as opposed to, to what's taken days or even weeks in the past in a cool. physical environment. Very cool. All right. Thanks, Chad.